Meanwhile, Germany has suspended a number of officers suspected of sharing extremist content in online chat groups. These suspects are facing charges of spreading Nazi propaganda and hate speech. According to reports, 29 German police officers have been sharing pictures of Adolf Hitler and the violent neo-Nazi propaganda pictures over their phones. The officers are also said to have joined far-right chat rooms where numerous other Nazi symbols have been shared. Wir reden hier von übelster und widerwärtigster neonazistischer, rassistischer und flüchtlingsfeindlicher Hetze. Weit über 100 Bilddateien. Die Zahlen kann ich Ihnen nicht genau benennen, weil die sich jetzt auch ständig weiterentwickelt. Also Bilddateien weit über 100 mit strafrechtlich relevanten Inhalten, wie zum Beispiel Bilder von Hitler, von Hakenkreuzen, von Reichskriegsflaggen, aber noch viel abscheulichere Bilder wie etwa der fiktiven Darstellung eines Flüchtlings in der Gaskammer, eines Konzentrationslagers oder einer verächtlich machenden Darstellung der Erschießung von Menschen mit schwarzer Hausfarbe. Now this of course is not the first case to raise some serious concerns in Germany about the far-right attitude amongst the police. Five questionable chat groups within the past, in the recent past, have been discovered amongst the forces in Western Germany. In the central state of Hessen, investigators are looking into hate mail campaigns against politicians and public figures and they have stumbled upon a chat group that was used to exchange extremist content. A similar group was also discovered in the southern state of Bavaria last year in which hate speech targeting Muslims had been shared. However, these incidents have always been discussed as just individual incidents in Germany. Now, the German police and security services have long faced accusations that they are not doing enough to these extremists within their ranks. Now, after this latest incident, a special commissioner is to be appointed and he will of course look into the affairs of extremist content being shared within the police chat groups. Rechtsextremisten und Neonazis haben in der nordrhein-westfälischen Polizei, in unserer Polizei, nichts, aber auch gar nichts zu suchen. Da muss man glasklare politische Kante zeigen. Now this of course is a sensitive issue in a country where awareness of the World War II genocide of millions of Jews by the Nazis under Hitler is very strong. However, the police forces in Germany are governed by the each individual state. Black Lives Matter protests this summer have really highlighted the problem of racism amongst parts of the police force. There was also a call to launch a nationwide investigation by the police, but it was cancelled by the German interior minister this summer.